The European Union, the United States, Britain and others have hit Russia with a wide range of sanctions after its invasion into Ukraine, a set freezes, travel bans and restriction on Russian billionaires. The President and the Foreign Minister have also not been spared. The Russian ruble has plunged to historic lows and the economy is expected to plunge even further. Let's also talk about the broadest category of sanctions that have been imposed and these are three to be precise. Firstly, financial sanctions. Western leaders have now frozen the assets of Russia's central bank, limiting the bank's ability to access international dollar reserves. The British government has also banned Britons from making transactions with the Russian banks, its finance ministry and also its wealth fund. The Western allies have agreed to remove selected Russian banks from the SWIFT messaging system. Major Russian banks are being excluded from Britain's financial system and all Russian banks will have their assets frozen. A limit is also expected to be placed on bank deposits made by Russian nationals. Secondly, there are also trade curbs with Russia. The United Kingdom, the EU, the US and other countries have announced curbs on products that can be sent to Russia. Like high-tech items, chemicals and lasers. The European Union is also banning the sale of aircraft and equipment to Russian airlines. Germany has put on hold the Nord Stream 2 gas pipeline project connecting Russia to Germany. And the third set of sanctions cover individuals. The United States has now placed a travel ban on the Russian President Vladimir Putin himself and his Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov. The alliance has also frozen the assets owned by Putin and Lavrov in the US, EU, United Kingdom and Canada. There's also a long hit list of Russian oligarchs and their properties. The United Kingdom is limiting the sale of citizenship via golden passports and the Western Alliance has now launched a transatlantic task force to identify and freeze the assets of sanctioned individuals and companies. They also aim to target officials and elites close to the Russian government as well as their families. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.